Hello guys, welcome to another video of Nerdy Tech Tips channel. Today we're going to learn how to overclock your CPU. Now overclocking a CPU was very hard in olden days and it did, it did require a lot of knowledge and you needed to know what settings to change and you mainly did that in motherboard settings. Now with the Intel CPUs it's very easy. Um, they have actually a great utility that will allow you to overclock just in few clicks so it will handle everything for you and if you're overclocking too much and your processor is heating up it will handle everything for you so you're not damaging your machine so let's get started let's see how we can do overclocking in intel extreme utility first thing you need to go to uh, google and search for intel extreme utility tuning utility this is the one that we're looking for we're gonna go ahead and download this one just install the software all right after you install this it does require a restart it's pretty annoying when I need to restart my PC all the time after installing some kind of software. That's okay. Let's get it restarted. So we have successfully restarted our PC. Now we're going to open Intel Extreme Utility. Because the drivers are not present install the latest version in 10 all right seems like we are missing some drivers I did fresh installation of this Windows probably that's why all right So it's starting up and, and I did not even update any drivers. That's a little bit strange. But let's open it up. As you can see, my CPU here is i9-9900K. And over here you can see it's throttling, current limit throttling. We're gonna go ahead and Control. The reason why it's hitting 4.9 gigahertz on all cores at the moment is because in my motherboard settings I have selected run all cores at maximum speed possible so that's why it's happening so over here what we need to do is we can simply just change the speed let's hit all the cores to 5 gigahertz apply and as you can see now it's hitting all the cores at 5 gigahertz so actually that's how easy it is to overclock in Intel extreme utility now you do want to run your testing because I'm using really budget uh, water cooling here so I might not be able to run it properly and it's going to probably hit 100 degrees Celsius if I run stress test but if you do have a better cooling system you might want to just run stress test anyway to see what temperatures you're hitting to check the temperatures I usually use this application core temperature you can google it and download it it's a really small application and it's very useful now we're gonna run some stress tests for five minutes and see what happens
as you can see we have finished stress test well I would recommend you to run stress test for at least 30 minutes I did that for 5 minutes just to represent how it works also keep an eye on any kind of throttling you might experiencing you might experience even though I used really budget water cooling which I ordered from Aliexpress it's doing pretty good job and maximum temps we hit was 87 degrees celsius Intel Extreme Tuning Utility is the safest and best way for anyone new to overclocking like myself. If you are experiencing any kind of throttling, do your research because it could be happening for many reasons. Two main reasons that I have personally experienced are First, I was using budget motherboard. When I experienced current limit throttling and I was not even hitting 60 degrees Celsius. Second time, it tried to limit power by throttling power limit. It happened because for some reason my temperature threshold for my CPU was set to 70 degrees Celsius. Well thanks for watching this video, I hope you learned something today and we'll see you again.